as you've probably noticed, I've noticed, the last few weeks in the vlogs we have shown quite a bit of snowboarding, but it's all been of me basically. So we're gonna do a special effort to rectify that. This morning's task is fix snowboards. We had a few casualties at the winter camp, bindings that broke and stuff like that. Got to sort that out, got a weekend coming up, big trip to Radisha, um, which is a nice mountain, a bit south of here. Um, we're actually going to meet up with guys from Chaplin and, and Sarajevo there. Sunday we're going to be taking a group of younger girls for their first time up on the mountain here above Yaitza. So. Yeah, it's been fun trying to work out how stuff goes together. I think I'm close to getting the maximum number of boards we can up and running again. I think this morning can be counted as a success. So this is that moment when you're on the ski lift and it stops and you're just bouncing up and down. Flip. I don't like it. <laughs> I don't like it, but at least I can jump here. Yeah. No problem. We're not in the worst bit of the lift. That's the worst <laughs> thing is when you're at the highest point of the lift over the ground and you think, if I were to jump off this lift, I'd break something. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> but this is good. If we'd stop 50 meters up the line, it's really windy, but where we are, it's not windy at all. Here we go. Table guard. So basically, that means someone fell over at the top trying to get off in a dangerous <laughs> way, that they had to stop it so other people didn't crash into them as they came off. So there's a problem here, the tree is too high. We came up on this lift a couple of years ago on the opening day and as we came over this bit there was just they'd made a couple of pieces but basically it was all like untouched snow and it was just an amazing view. It was a day like this, blue skies, just clear, clear skies, uh, sunshine and yeah, not quite like that today, but still pretty beautiful. We absolutely do not understand people who take the lift just for the scenic view. Why would you put yourself through the uh, the tension the <laughs> of riding something like this if you're not going to get off and snowboard at the end? So sometimes you've just got to stop and admire the view. And uh, that is what I'm doing, assuming a position of admiration. <laughs> I think, for me, that's the reason to come here, to Radisha, it's the place where we are today, is to come here, where I am, just to be on the top of everything, have a look around, just massive views. Raman, it was very disappointed that she wasn't able to do the trip today, and it wasn't that she wasn't allowed, it's just that she really couldn't face the thought of the ride up on the chairlift, which is totally understandable. But as you've probably noticed, I've noticed, in the last few weeks in the vlogs we have shown quite a bit of snowboarding, but it's all been of me basically. And tomorrow we've got a trip up above Yaitza to Ranch, and we've got I think at least four, maybe six girls coming, it'll be their very first time trying snowboarding. So that will be a day for me at the bottom of the mountain, really helping them and helping Rowan. We'll show you what that looks like. Um, as for me, I am going to enjoy myself up here. I'm thinking of just kind of lapping on this bit up here because over there it's just soft and smooth. You can make big turns. We might try and get some really slow mo slashy footage, stuff like that. That's my plan. That's what we're going to do now.
And so, that's it for Radisha. But I'll be back tomorrow with Rowan on ranch. So it's a sunny Sunday after the up on ranch. We've got six school kids and a school teacher that we're teaching snowboarding this afternoon. snowboarding it's something that I never ever wanted to try and when Matt bought me a snowboard I was just like what did you do that for I'm never gonna stand on it there you go I did and I'm still pretty rubbish but I'm having fun so what you can kind of see over my shoulder is very much the Sunday afternoon vibe up here at the local ski slope you've got lots of kids out tobogganing you've got parents teaching kids how to ski you've got us teaching people how to snowboard and you've got some people using the main slope over there who can actually ski and occasionally you see someone else snowboarding here, but not very often. That's it, all that remains today. Thanks very much for watching. Do give us a big thumbs up, leave a comment or a question, and remember that together we do adventure. We'll see you next time.